I know that I've already cut a hole. I'm about to cut another hole. But just like something about how they teach you that these Sharpie markers are permanent makes this feel more permanent than cutting a hole in the van, mentally. I'm such a weird person. All right, today I'm installing this fan window. Nope, I did the fan a while ago. This is a window. All right, today I'm installing this window, which is the last big hole that's gonna be cut in this van. Uh, and it, it's in, so that's how, that's how it went, but there was a lot of struggles along the way. And I'm definitely stalling. It's about noon right now and I haven't done anything. Um, I'm just getting to this and I'm gonna eat first. I'm definitely stalling. This part honestly scares me a little bit more than the fan did because it's a bigger hole. I don't exactly know where the bed's gonna be yet, height wise. I'm gonna put it on the driver's side, up above where the bed's gonna go. I also need to take out a support. Let's clean this van up a little bit and then we'll get to it. Okay, so the first step is I've gotta take out this beam. Um, this is generally this right area of where the window is gonna be. It's not the right area, but generally that's where it's gonna go. This is the driver's side of the vehicle. Even if everything goes wrong, this support's coming out one way or another. Is this the easiest way to do this? I feel like there's no way this is the easiest way to do this. Okay, this video is not gonna just be bang, bang, bang. Okay. There we go. That one's loose. We got one. You see how focused I am? What are you doing? Beating the crap out of this chisel to get this out. <laughs> is there an easier way, you think? Oh, I, kn I knew there was probably 100% easier way. I got I got some drill bits new in the package that you just go boop, drill out that spot weld. <laughs> Why? Why isn't that what I did first? Chisel the I mean, shit it should, it shouldn't yeah, be, it it shouldn't be welded to anything anymore. Yeah. Just like that. <laughs> Damn the internet. Every, I bet this whole, like, Band build is gonna be me doing something like how the internet says, and then you'll come in and be like, Yeah, I can get it done in like two seconds. Yeah. <laughs> Should be able to just rip it off. We got the piece off. I'm getting it from both sides today. They drop. All right. All right, so on the inside, we've got to now make a template and uh, kind of drill pilot holes from the inside because on the inside I can tell there's a straight across beam and I can measure from there to make sure it's flat. Um, so, and then from there we'll drill out little pilot holes and then from the outside we'll drill bigger holes and then, and then from there uh, cut the hole. Oh yeah, let's open up the window. Oh, you can tell how tired I am because of how long it takes me to open a box. Window to the wall. To the wall. That's a window. And it's not cracked or nothing, so I say we install it. I'm just gonna put this out here so it's easier to work. I'll make sure to measure a bunch of times, but basically gonna just Draw a sharpie line, right? That sounds right. Yeah, why does it? Then we put the cardboard on top of it, maybe? Because it was sitting on this and then wobbling. We could cut this out and just try it. I don't like this one. Looks like my camera overheated. So just in case you missed that whole thing, I cut out a template. This is pretty much good, it fits. I had to cut out that little hole in the middle so that the slider would fit while I'm cutting the template, or while I'm drawing out the template. So now I think we got one. Disregard all the tape. That's already up here. So much disregard for it, let's just take it down. Divide 53 by two kids. That's gonna be 26 and a half. This is the middle, not this. You would get tricked out and say this is the middle, but then we're gonna put walls up and none of this framing is gonna matter. I need my Sharpie, hold up everybody. This is so tough. 
This is this is a really tough thing to commit to. I hold it up. Oh, sick. I was like, oh, I'm gonna need, look at how many pieces of tape I put up there, and I only need one. Okay. We wanna make sure that this measurement, this measurement, and this measurement are all the same so that it's level. And right now, clearly, not level. Just to be safe, I'm gonna put the window up to it and just make sure that it's pretty much on there. There's a part of me that wants to measure this one more time. Yeah, no, you can never be too safe. 36 and a quarter. Uh, one thing I just realized, <laughs> one more thing, <laughs> it's, uh, I'm not st stalling. I'm not stalling, I'm not stalling. <sighs> you think the Mets are gonna go all the way this year? Maybe. Let me, this is where I wanted it, right? Does that look slanted? Holy cow, am I like double thinking everything right now? Sell the van, trash it. I'm too nervous to put the fan in. Does that look off? Inch and a half. Just over an inch and a half. Just over an inch and a half. That's like two inches. That's about as good as it'll get ever. That's two and a half. That's two and a half. That's two and a half. That's just slightly under two and a half, but definitely manageable considering I didn't cut the cardboard exactly. Okay. That's it, I've confirmed. Can you see that? You see that? I'm pointing at it now. That's a hole. I can always drill another hole, I can't undrill. We got holes, you can kind of see them. They're in the shape of a window. They're gonna be perfect, but I am such an idiot. Okay. There's a handful of band-aids in there somewhere. You know, it's, it's, it's a stupid question, but like which side was up, which side was down. I've now got a camera cat. You quit? What do you mean you quit? <laughs> Chill up there, man. No, that's how you turn it. And then the blinker is right up there too. Yeah, that's the blinker. Yeah, no, that'll be useful, I'm sure. You, you, if you use it, you're smarter than most humans. The sun is in my eyeballs. <laughs> that was the joy I needed there, cat. You are the rock of my existence right now. Cat, you want some cardboard? You don't look like you want cardboard. I will do that. What are you doing, cat? No, that's my that's my ladder. <laughs> the cat's on the ladder. Squeeze by you there, cat. Oh god, he's touching my butt. The cat's touching my butt. Alright, ten little pilot holes. Gotta be turned into ten big pilot holes. That one really went. I think we're fine. I think I did this right. That was silly. Three more. Okay. I can hear the van crying. You want me to just do all this for you? I'm kind of... I'll do maybe, it. Maybe I'll do one of the easy ones. <laughs> I, I don't mind doing it. I'm tight to the top. Are you? So your holes are a little uh, bigger than they needed to be. It'll, it'll be covered. Yeah, it'll be covered and with the tape and everything. That'll be fine. I'm going to let the professional do his thing. Can I call you a professional? Is this... Am I being, are paid, you, am I being paid for this? Eh, maybe. I'll give you a quarter. Well, then I'm a professional. Do He's a pro. You right on that lens flare the whole time. Yeah, do it. It's got a little metal filings oh, on my arm. Stuff. Very yeah. hot. Yes. Woo! Damn, that almost does look like I'm a professional. He's 
here. He knows how to do it. I'm gonna let him do it, you know? That's the smartest thing I didn't even understand. That's, yeah. No, that's how you should do it right there. Anyway, I'm done for the day. <laughs> I didn't cut quite, quite enough yeah. off. Yeah, you're good. Nothing a blowtorch won't fix. <laughs> Is that the go-to tool? Sometimes. <laughs> Nope, maybe I got it. Oh! Who thought that was gonna be hot? <laughs> oh. Are you okay? I'm okay. Okay, I thought I'd ask that just because I pointed a camera at you and I was okay. like... <laughs> An old it. machinist once said, when you burn your fingers, put them on your ear and you'll never get a burn. Is that a, wait, how? <laughs> what? I waited too long. It's worked for me in the past. Is it just Pinch colder? Your and then like the pain goes away and you won't get blisters. All right. If you do it right away, I swear to God, it shouldn't work. It's stupid, but it works. Don't get, don't get me swearing on camera. Grandma doesn't know. Okay. <laughs> Perfect. Safety 101, kids. Do that. <laughs> okay. Yeah, perfect. Sorry if I'm gassing you. That's okay. I haven't been high for weeks. Uh, gotta go to your left a lot. There we go. And then this. How many of those screws do you think it needs? Oh, hold it, hold it. You got it? Yeah. Yeah, this thing goes this way. So you think I just screw it in, huh? All right, I'm gonna go grab something to eat. You got this for a little bit? Yep. Should be able to let go. Okay. I mean, it's got three screws in it. So we can really eyeball that body line. And I would say this corner has to go down or this corner has to go up about an eighth of an inch. Come on. Nah. You know what? It's pretty damn close. Yeah, no, I'd take an eighth of an inch or whatever you said, or a quarter. I think we're better than that. I think we wiggled it to the 16th. Woo! We got a window in. like that we have a window that's one of the harder parts done <sighs> I'm really glad my uncle helped with that because it went way faster and I would have been here for probably a couple more hours if I didn't if you enjoyed uh, subscribe and follow along with the van build I appreciate it thank you for watching it was moving my van I think I only moved it to Sanford and moved maybe like 10 feet were you wondering the whole time? Oh, <laughs> my